Miss Carlyle, I apologize for upsetting you, but I assure you this is a genuine enterprise and that was a serious test. Hi, I'm Kai. Today we'll look at Lockwood and Coast series and learn new English idioms and words. With flying colors, upsetting, assure, genuine, enterprise, haunted, and others. Ready? Let's watch. Miss Carlyle, I apologize for upsetting you. Miss Carlyle, I apologize for upsetting you. Upsetting means making someone feel worried, unhappy, or angry. Miss Carlyle, I apologize for upsetting you, but I assure you this is a genuine enterprise. But I assure you this is a genuine enterprise. Assure means to tell someone confidently that something is true, especially so that they do not worry. Genuine. If something is genuine, it is real and exactly what it appears to be. Enterprise here means an organization, especially a business. But I assure you this is a genuine enterprise and that was a serious test. And that was a serious test. And that was a serious test on which you passed with flying colors. Which you passed with flying colors. With flying colors is an idiom. If you do something such as pass an exam with flying colors, you do it very successfully. On which you passed with flying colors. You'd be amazed how many candidates we have coming here and make up some cock and bull story. You'd be amazed how many candidates make up some cock and bull story. Candidate here means a person who is competing to get a job. Cock and bull story means a story that is obviously not true, especially one given as an excuse. You'd be amazed how many candidates we have coming here and make up some cock and bull story. It'd be the most haunted cup in London if the mildest of their tales were true. It'd be the most haunted cup in London if the mildest of their tales were true. Haunted here means often visited by ghosts. It'd be the most haunted cup in London if the mildest of their tales were true. You'd better tell her about the biscuit roll. What? Tell her about the biscuit rule. What? You'd better tell her about the biscuit rule. What? She can't just go taking two at once like that. She can't go taking two at once like that. She can't just go taking two at once like that. The rule is each member of the agency can only take one biscuit at a time in strict rotation. Each member of the agency can only take one biscuit at a time in strict rotation. Strict here means exactly correct. The rule is each member of the agency can only take one biscuit at a time in strict rotation. Great work. You have completed the learning section of this lesson. Please take a moment to check if you subscribe. And now it's time to test yourself by watching the clip without subtitles. Miss Carla, I apologize for upsetting you, but I assure you this is a genuine enterprise and that was a serious test on which you passed with flying colors. You'd be amazed how many candidates we have coming here and make up some cock and bull story. It'd be the most haunted cup in London if the mildest of their tales were true. You'd better tell her about the biscuit roll. What? She can't just go taking two at once like that. The rule is, each member of the agency can only take one biscuit at a time in strict rotation. Excellent. Watching English series is an effective way of improving your language skills. Make sure to check if you are subscribed for more helpful videos like this one. Have a nice day.